In further developments in the very same story, the AICC in charge, Gaurav Pandey is one of four uh, leaders at a similar position. He's deleted his tweet. Uh, I also want to tell you that one of the things we do know is that in the hours after his tweet, senior Congress leaders had told our reporters that they did disapprove of those comments. So this isn't entirely unexpected. But now I believe he's deleted that set of tweets. My colleague Pallavi Ghosh is with us right now to bring us more details. Pallavi, till just a few hours ago, those tweets were live. I want to understand from you, A, could you tell us more about what went on behind the scenes and B, can we expect more? If the BJP ups the ante and demands more action, could we perhaps expect more action or is this where it's likely to end? I mean, frankly speaking, uh, many in the Congress party see him as a way junior person. So right. they're not wanting to blow this up out of proportion. But the timing of the tweet is something which certainly did not meet with much approval. Uh, the fact is that... Uh, you know, the Congress party has often been critical of the former Prime Minister Atal Bihari Vajpayee. But, you know, in politics, you need to get the perception and the timing right. Off late, if you've been noticing a trend within the Congress, they have actually been using the former Prime Minister Atal Bihari Vajpayee to hit out at the present Prime Minister to say that he should learn his idea of governance from Atal Bihari Vajpayee. Second, when I remember Vajpayee ji died, Rahul Gandhi and Sonia Gandhi were one of the first ones to rush to pay tribute to him. But what's even worse timing was the fact that today in the morning, Rahul Gandhi went to visit and pay tributes to many Samadhis and one of them was uh, that of Atal Bihari Vajpayee. So, you know, just a day before Rahul Gandhi is supposed to go to a Samadhi, you have a situation where there is a tweet which goes out from someone who is attached to a Congress president's office. It's very, very bad optics. It comes across as very, very bad politics. That met with a lot of disapproval. They felt that the timing was wrong, that the optics was wrong. And someone who's no longer alive to make these kind of comments just does not augur well for the Congress party. And hence, there has been a strong disapproval for his tweet asking him to take it down. Pallavi, thank you for bringing us these details. Can I just request